Look, I have a tiny Christmas tree because I'm actually excited about Christmas this year. How fucking awesome is that? Hello everyone, how's it going? It's been a while since you've seen this face. You've heard my voice a couple of times if you've been watching my Hearthstone videos. If you haven't been watching them, it's okay, you know? Um, gaming videos is not for everyone, but thank you to those who have commented and, you know, just watched the videos and liked them. It's really great because I enjoy playing Hearthstone even though I fucking suck. And for those of you who have been watching my Hearthstone videos, um, last video I talked about how I was not going to make any vlogs because I look like shit. <laughs> My body hates me at the moment because I am super stressed. And that's actually what I wanted to make a video about today is stress. It's something that everyone will experience or has experienced. So the thing is, at the moment, uh, as I mentioned, my body hates me. It's getting a bit better now. I had like sits all over my chin and my fucking forehead and just everywhere on my cheeks. It was really, it was horrible. For those of you who know me, you know, personally or just watch my videos since I was five, I am not a person who gets sits very often. Sometimes I get spots and all that stuff, but sits, not really. And it's just a way for my body to say, hey, Louise, slow the fuck down. Personally, I'm really bad at handling stress. I work best under stress, which is the worst thing. <laughs> but right now, having a full-time job and writing my bachelor, it's just been so stressful because I felt so behind on my bachelor project. At the same time, I wanted to do my best at work because I've been working there for almost four months now, but I still want to, you know, give this this well impression that I actually give a shit. I didn't feel like I could show it to my colleagues how much I actually care about my job because I have every Wednesday off to make my bachelor project. And at the same time, while I was having my off time, I felt very uninspired and very tired. You know, sometimes I just fall asleep and my boyfriend can wake me up. But I just finished a programming course and I don't feel as behind as before. Slow down, just chill. You're, you're good to go, Louise. It's it's okay, you get a thumbs up, big, big thumbs up from here. For my bachelor project, I am doing a product uh, with gamification elements. I want to write about what motivates people and how gamification can motivate people um, to do kind of boring stuff. But my parents, they know me very well. And <laughs> I saw them here a couple of weeks ago when I was at a Hearthstone tournament that my brother's girlfriend had arranged. And then my mom messaged me like, hey, why don't you come home a weekend and just relax? So I'm going home this weekend and I'm really excited. I'm going to see my grandma and my parents, of course, and I'm just going to relax and bake Christmas cookies with my mom. And at the same time, I can focus on actually writing some more stuff on my bachelor project. I slowly started today, but there's only a month left. I can already feel the pimples. <laughs> no, but it's gonna be fine. The worst thing is, as I said, I work best under stress. And I think a lot of people actually feel that way. They work best under pressure. And that's because humans are lazy. You and me both. We're lazy. We're humans. That's in our nature. <laughs> We're horrible. <laughs> no, but I feel like I should give some advice. Get away from where you're doing your project. Take a one day trip somewhere yourself. Sometimes to go to the beach, go for a walk. Just do something to please yourself. Masturbate. And it's nice just to get out of your little stress bubble sometimes. You know, you're allowed to watch an episode of that series you just started. You're allowed to play a game of Hearthstone. You're allowed to do this and this and this. You have to reward yourself for actually doing something, but that also means that we actually have to do something. Another great way to handle stress, I feel, is like making goals of your day. At my job, we have daily stand-ups, which doesn't mean we do like, so why did a chicken cross the road? <laughs> it means in my team, um, we tell each other what we did yesterday and what we're going to do today. And it's really motivating for me. So yeah, I just thought I'd just talk about this subject. I know it's not the most sexy subject. I hope this can somehow help you if you watched through the whole video. I don't know, but congratulations if you did, you get a badge. That's gamification for you. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it or if you found it a bit helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Uh, 
my head was like itchy. Check out my last two videos if you like Hearthstone because my last two, actually three videos were Hearthstone. There will be more of that because it's easier for me in this stressful situation because it takes much longer to edit these vlogs than it does to press record and stop recording and upload. <laughs> Again, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time. I don't know why I'm shaking my head. <laughs> Bye!